Hello, my name is Aschalo. Uh, let us see how to create a traffic separator or median with a single uh, assembly. Uh, for this case, I have proposed alignments and with uh, finished grid for all alignments. Uh, an easy way to create this traffic separator. First, uh, we will uh, change this uh, polyline properly uh, after connecting or proper connection, then we'll change uh, this uh, polyline to uh, alignment. Uh, we'll change alignment from the object. We'll select this one, uh, then OK. It is right median edge. We don't need a radius, and uh, we don't need to delete it just in case. Therefore, we have this alignment. We have this alignment. Let me change this style. Let's say. This one here it is this is the alignment is created. Uh, let's change also this one uh, existing. Uh, sorry, uh, let's make it a style of offset. This is the alignment left median edge alignment. So we need to be we need, we need to use this one as uh, target. So we'll change this one also to alignment. So create alignment from the object. The name will be left median or left median edge don't need curve don't need to delete because if in case any this then uh, this one also sorry this uh, style the same is offset it's okay so when i finish this one so i will give the profile the profile the profile will be created from the corridor so first let's create the corridor this is auxiliary corridor we can uh, we, we can give any name so but the alignment will select uh, the main alignment the entrance road then the finished grid assembly i will come and i will select this one all it creates surface from this corridor i'll make it okay then as much as possible I'll try to make it uh, the frequency is very small or make it dense uh, make it dense for accurate uh, profile but it will affect your computer performance no problem with this short uh, length once i finished i will come here okay this let me change this uh, style uh, to see the link insertion this is code it is uh, all so like this then i will create from this uh, i will create the top surface create this top surface I will add the surface I'll say uh, top finished uh, uh, it's okay it's the name no problem you can give whatever you like so I will add the top link uh, then links I will add crown and uh, edge of travel way I will add then I'll select this one then I'll give this um, extent boundary that's finished Therefore, I'll select my alignment. I'll select alignment. Then I'll create a profile that is a top finished. So I'll add. It's okay. It's okay. This one. Then the next also. I'll give this one. Uh, as uh, I, I'll use this as a target, elevation target. The, the, then I'll, I don't need this one. I'll delete uh, this one. Uh, okay. Let's go uh, uh, create the assembly for this purpose so we'll create a new assembly we'll make it name main interest it's okay it's name so i'll put it here then the important uh, sub assembly is um, sorry i'll bring this one the important sub assembly for this purpose is the uh, tamper one this one lane i'll come here is this one lane from tamper median uh, one so i'll select this i'll check okay then it is right side it's okay i'll put it and uh, let me change the name right lane right lane right lane uh, i'll change also this one left side left lane i'll select it okay oh sorry the name i forget uh, left lane left lane Let's change the material divs if you want. 
then let's change uh, leave it as it is for it is for demonstration purpose uh, let's make the wheels uh, a little bit bigger let's make it's okay to uh, it's okay it's a big uh, wide wide this a big uh, road uh, then uh, what this does uh, it will uh, the inner edge when you get uh, target it will open and close so let's create the main uh, corridor here it is uh, create corridor we will give main entrance road entrance okay the name is fine uh, entrance road then we'll select this one the entrance road we'll select finished surface then we'll select the assembly which is created now then we don't have a uh, uh, walkway and the uh, surface target for the time being then let's say okay now let's give this uh, frequency let's see it uh, uh, we'll give uh, this uh, frequency then we'll give the target so media outside we'll select entrance left if it's not visible you can drag like this uh, median uh, entrance road left i'll select uh, median edge that we created the median edge the median edge left is uh, left then uh, the next one is uh, uh, left right lane right lane right lane miss entrance right the opposite one the median edge i will select the median edge left the median edge right so make sure this one is median left Le left yes it's okay let us see is okay very good so when you see you can check this one by uh, taking this is the frequency issue uh, we'll correct it we'll make it this so let's see this one so this is our this is this one uh, can give any code set okay then when you see this one let's move here yeah this is you can see it is closed no traffic separator or median here when you make it there is a traffic separator then the next point is to add this curve stone on here and here and they connect the top link so in this case what we are going to do is, is we need to add offset so add offset to the right and to the left we can make it here then uh, again in the left side also we can add here so then in this case the most important point is we need to identify our look at this point uh, what we are going to do we didn't add we don't want to add a uh, curve but at the separator location we need uh, we want to add uh, curve so in this case i use a horizontal target conditional target so i'll come here and i'll find the conditional target let's find it here it's conditional target then uh, i'll select this one this uh, the name here it is let's make, let's make it uh, left it's okay left then the name is uh, i'll give the name is the, the naming is very important right median or separator median edge found found we'll make it this one the next one is uh, we'll change this uh, not found not found we make it here right median edge not found not found then we make it this also read then uh, can easily mirror this one okay here it is okay so we, we then we delete this section when it was the media if it gets the media it will add curve so i will come here let's find our curve uh, our curve is created by me so i'll select this one and uh, i'll put it like this okay this is a curve if it's get this uh, horizontal target it will give this target then then i will select this one and this one i will mirror to here in the for the left side select this one this i'll set left 
okay curve no matter then I'll select also this one I'll set mirror this one this one is left left okay then when I finish this one when I finish this one I'll come here I'll select this uh, my my uh, corridor I'll go to property and in parameter so I'll put my sorry I'll put my target here so the right median is okay uh, therefore uh, I'll find I need only uh, first let's get uh, target found or not found left edge right edge left edge right edge so in this case what I use is with layer the middle of uh, sorry for, for, for let me show you here first uh, I put some uh, polylines here so let me turn on uh, this layer here it is so when I turn this layer this is the target so it select this one and corridor let me uh, say target uh, no 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 um, here it should give me I think uh, let me let me review it first let me check this one again yes this one uh, for I know I create first this one the right side so I'll select right median edge right median edge then the next one is left median edge left median edge oh the name is uh, not properly skewed but I'll select okay this means left median edge I'm not sure uh, which one is I made a mistake this one is uh, left median edge this one uh, then I'll give elevation yes it has elevation it will detect automatically then I'll go uh, targeting so the first target is left found or not all found in the same target the same target all is at the center to the insertion that means the, the yellow one okay they will target when they when, when it finds this line it will create the curve and not found to not create therefore I'll select this one for all of them the same target same target I'll select this one select this one I'll select this one then I'll say okay then a frequency I'll make it very dense 0 0.5 here this on the curve also 0 0.5 but I'll come here in on the target I'll make it by increment 0 0.25 very much dense to see the effect okay then I'll make it reviewed yes let me just perfectly it's done with a single uh, sub assembly uh, let me change the code here it is uh, let's make it this one I think here and let's create the top surface so here one is the top surface finish surface finish surface it's naming no problem the top link is I'll add top then I have a lot others point curve stone inclined face yes I curve stone top I think this is enough then I add some links I will add this one edge of travel I will add uh, uh, curve, uh, curve 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 top front I will add curve insertion and I don't think so uh, curve uh, back of curve back of curve I will add then I will add boundary to extent it's added and then OK yeah it's perfect so I'll select okay the outside uh, I don't think so it may not uh, selected the target let's add also the target here the outside okay this one is lane I'll select only lanes right lane and left lane uh, and you can hit that. then the outer the outer side the outer side uh, left it selected something because it is green I know it is this left main interest it's all right then I'll come this one it's also selected something interest right interest 
in trans in trans right yeah it's a selected i don't know uh, uh in trans rights it's a selected uh in trans rights it was selected i think uh, it's the main road it's in trans road in trans road left this one okay so i'll deselect the first one i'll select the, the second one also i need to check this one um yeah this is this is i'll deselect this one it's okay I make it very dense to see the top surface. Yeah, then uh, I'll make it, uh, I'll select the surface. Let's see how it's, uh, it's workers. So object view, oh, the, the target is not okay here. Uh, the target is not okay here, the outer one. It goes somewhere outside. So again, I'm sorry for this. Uh, I'll select this one, I will again, somewhere it goes i'll select this one for the left lane i'll, I'll deselect all i'll deselect all then i'll select it manually this one finished for the right for the right also i'll come here for the right lane i'll come this outside so i deselect i think this right yes i, I deselect this one i deselect this one i'll select manually this I hope there is one uh, element here. Yes, it's selected for me. So I'll make it this one. I'm sorry. So when I select the target, yes, perfect. Perfect. Then uh, let us select our surface and let's see how it works. So let's see object view. So let's make this one a little bit. Yeah, focus. You see, yeah, you see, it works perfectly. So it's very easy to add any type of traffic separator with a single uh, sub assembly. With a single sub assembly. So let's close this one, and you need to use this one, the target, the offset uh, assembly. This is a very nice tool. Uh, thank you very much. If you like this video. Yo, please uh, like, share, and su subscribe. Uh, you will be notified uh, when we release uh, a new video. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you.